The great blue heron is an ideal species for teaching children about habitat conservation and species at risk. At the Salt Spring Conservancy, we do this through the Heron Champions Program. Heron Champions is one of several award-winning educational programs developed by the Conservancy to inspire and teach about conservation, programs aimed at getting every student in our school system out into nature every year. Heron Champions begins in the classroom. Tapping into student interest in animals and nature, we explore questions about the heron's life. What do students know about the great blue heron? What do students wonder about them? By sharing and building on knowledge and wonder over the course of several weeks, the Heron Champions program fosters deep learning that will keep these students engaged for a lifetime. During our weekly visits, students explore the herons through art, literature, and science activities. Storytelling and art help to broaden students' perspectives. One First Nations artist, Quinton Harris, inspired students to interweave artistic forms into natural history stories. By doing art, students learn that creativity and nature go hand in hand, gaining insights that go far beyond what can be learned from books or internet. Science activities are a big hit too. They investigate feathers to see how herons keep warm and dry, despite constantly being out in the weather. Beak and feeding adaptations are explored through science that brings adaptation models right out of the kitchen. More observation of all birds, not just herons, comes out of these explorations. Student appreciation and value for wildlife and habitat grows in leaps and bounds as students visit natural areas near the school. The discussion centers around all needs of herons, from food and defense against predators to habitat for nesting and raising their young. We're going to start with the materials that are there. You're going to find a really nice spot to start a nest, so you're really going to be a heron starting a new nest. And even though heron nests are in the tops of tall trees, building a heron nest on the forest floor is a powerful connection. The small twigs there and the larger ones on the outside. Whoa. I think we need more soft stuff. I'm popping this side up. Feel, feel this in here. Feel this in here. Can I go in it? Our little heron baby. Oh. We must protect her. We oh. must protect her. Protect her. Protect her. <laughs> <laughs> yes. ah. 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 At the end of the day, students have a deeper understanding of species at risk and many heartfelt hopes for the survival of herons. Writing down their hopes for the future is another step toward becoming a heron champion. We hope that heron champions go on to become champions of habitats, of species at risk, champions of nature conservation for future generations. <laughs>